Check uh, in my locality, the Dohar and Juma prayer in all of the Hanafi mosques uh, start at the Asr time instead of the Dohar time. And I read in Islam QA that the majority opinion is Juma ends with the start of Asr time. So can I leave Juma and pray Dohar at home until I find a mosque where it's prayed on time? And what is the ruling on someone's prayer who still prays Juma even though knowing that Juma starts at Asr time? First of all, those who pray Dhuhr, according to the Hanafi Madhab, if they don't know any better, and they are blind followers of their school of thought and of their scholars, there is no sin on them, because they are laymen, and they can't figure out which is right from wrong. Those who are a bit learned, and they have the evidences in front of them. And the hadiths of the Prophet ﷺ stating that the time of Dhuhr ends when the time of Asr begins. And this is when the shade of an erected ob object is equal in length to the erected object. And this is the opinion of the vast majority of schools of thought. So the Shafi'i, the Maliki, and the Hanbali school of thought agree on this because the hadith is crystal clear. So if you have a little bit of knowledge, you should know that I cannot pray dhuhr at the time of Asr intentionally and willingly. And I have to pray at the allocated time. Providing that this Hanafi masjid prays actually when the Asr time begins. He prays Dhuhr when the Asr time begins. Therefore, if you're certain that they pray Jumu'ah at the actual time of Asr, you cannot pray with them. You have to leave them and pray Dhuhr on your own. And definitely, if you look around with the grace of Allah, even in Bangladesh, you will find that there are masjids that follow the authentic opinions of the schools of thought and the Sunnah. Uh, whether it's Ahl Hadith or other messages and Allah knows best. Muhammad